Welcome! And in today's makeover, we are taking a very old chest of drawers and giving it a complete makeover with paint and decoupage paper. I bought this piece for only $5 at a sale and I think you can see why it was in really bad condition and the first step is to clean and prep and that meant taking out all of that old 1960s lining paper and wiping it all down and lightly sanding the piece to get any kind of oil or residue off of it before I apply the paint. This paint color is called Weeping Willow, and I also blended in a tad of another color called English Ivy. I just did that um, like on the sides and corners of the piece. These colors are both from Dixie Belle Paints. I seal the paint in a clear coat and it's the same clear coat that I use to seal the paper and I'll show you that in the next step. Now on to the paper. And to do this, I first cut off the white edges so that wouldn't show. And this paper is called Sepia Rose. Um, it's another product from Dixie Belle. And I'm going to apply it by using their clear coat with a sponge brush. I'm going to apply the clear coat all over the drawers and then onto the back of the paper for it to adhere. I was really lucky and this paper actually fit the front of my chest of drawers perfectly. It was the exact size to cover all three drawers as well as the slats in between. So I am going to use my hands just to smooth it out as best as I can. The next step is to cut off the excess paper using a razor blade and then go back in with your sponge brush and apply more of the clear coat on top of your paper to adhere it. The paper is actually pretty strong and it allows for you to kind of move it around when you're working on the project and it doesn't tear too easily, which is a big bonus. I then went in and added my new drawer poles. These are ceramic flower drawer poles that I purchased at Home Depot quite a few years ago now. And I'm taking an artist's brush and I'm painting in the keyholes and I also dry brushed around the drawer fronts as you can see here. I'm very happy to say that this piece found the perfect home. It was purchased by a music teacher and is going into her daughter's nursery. I hope you've enjoyed this video and if you have, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe.